Hello Twin Flames, it's Thursday the 18th of May today. My name's Liz and this is Guided by Angels. And I'm going to use the gorgeous Hermit Tarot today to bring in an energy around the feminine, the masculine, the journey. So what do we need to know? So thank you Angels, wow. Jumping straight out for the feminine here. And I've got one card jumping out on the floor there. What do we need to know for the Divine Masculines today please Angels? The energy around the masculines today. What do we need to know for the masculines on this powerful day? What do we need to know? One card at the back there. And the energy around the divine feminine and the connection. And the divine masculine and the connection. Jump straight out. Wow. So we've got an energy there for the connection. So let's have a look at this then for the feminine today. We've got no. I think we should see other people. I need more balance. Wow. I need more balance. Now, the first thing I've got coming through here is that you need more balance in your connection. In other words, they need to be able to give to you everything that you're able to give to them. That means if they can't do that for now, it needs to be a no. And there's a red flag that goes off when that happens, you know, because you're thinking, I don't want to see other people, but maybe we should see other people. So in other words, you're working out in your mind that if he can't be with you right now in this moment, it doesn't mean that you can't see other people. It doesn't mean that you should stop yourself from having options, even though you know you don't want anybody else. So I feel that what this is, is understanding that until he's ready to be able to give to you, and this is coming you know, all the readings are suggesting and showing that the masculine is getting ready for union, but feminines, you have to be ready too. And the thing is, understand this, the closer you get to union, the more you experience your own masculine energy. So you will also start going into your own fears as you feel things turning around. So you may start thinking, Mm, I think we should see other people because I need more balance. So no, I'm not ready yet. So it's amazing how we can feel ready. And then when we sense it's really coming, we can start moving into this energy where we go into fear. And we think maybe there is other people I need to see or other things I need to do. Or maybe I'm not quite ready. So I feel what this is showing to you is the feminine is operating in masculine energy too and it won't resonate with everyone there is some of you out there most of you in fact who know that you don't want to see other people but the point I'm making here is you know that you need this connection to be balanced that's also what the masculine wants to give to you and you're setting a boundary down saying no until you can give me everything I give to you then I understand that I'm willing to wait or I'm willing to work on me and maybe even date other people. The masculine is saying I'm terrified. So what he's terrified of is you seeing other people. He's terrified. He's saying, no, 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 no. I don't want you with anyone else. It makes him feel angry. So I'm feeling an anger coming in around the masculine because he's saying I'm terrified that you're going to see other people and then you're going to say no to me because I need to be more balanced and give you more balance. So when the masculine is terrified in that way, it means he's doing the work. It means that he's working it out. And this really resonates with, you know, the energies that have been coming through because he's been checking out your social media. He's been finding things out. He's been working out what he wants. And he's saying, I'm terrified of losing you. And we've got one pentacle coming up for the connection. And this is about a new beginning. So one pentacle or the ace of pentacles is an energy where something is coming. There's a proposal ahead. There's something moving forward. There's something being built and created. And this is all happening now. So in other words, whatever is going on within the connection is working for us because it's terrifying the masculine because he does not want you moving on. And this resonates with the DM to the F reading where the masculine was saying, who's there in the picture with you? I've been stalking your social media, your so you know, your social media. Maybe you should see other people or move on or get on with your life because he's in fear. But that's what he's terrified of. What he really wants is to make this work. He makes him angry and mad to think that you don't want him, that you could say no to him and yes to someone else. So the big message coming through here is 
he knows and you know that you need more balance and that's what's coming in so i'm going to do a clarifying message for this as well can we have a clarifier as well for this please if i follow you i could lose everything i just want you all the time so what i'm really feeling is you know the masculines really want to follow you on social media they want to be a, a Facebook friend to you or, or watch you or like your pictures or be around you. But they're afraid if they do that, they could lose everything. And this is the energy they're in in May. But between May and August, they're saying, I just want you all the time. I can't deny it. So to hell with the consequences. If I follow you, I could lose everything, but I'm not willing to lose you. I don't want you with anybody else. I get angry when I think about that. I'm just afraid. So what he's saying is if I follow you, I could lose everything, meaning he could lose his mind, you know, he could lose money, he could lose his children, he could lose, because he knows that he has to walk away from those things first to be with you. And I'm really feeling this energy coming through between now and August time, which really resonates with all the readings lately. He's moving away from what isn't good for his soul, and he's moving towards what is good for his soul, which includes you. So he's saying, of course, I want to follow you. Of course, I want to connect with you on social media because I know that we need more balance and I don't want you seeing other people and I want to see what you're doing. So I want to follow you on social media because I'm terrified that you're going to move on or you're going to say no to me. But what's being built in our life is something magical because I want you all the time. So the big message coming through here is trust the love. Things are not always what they seem. You don't need to be with anybody else. You know, at the end of the day, if you date someone else, all it's going to do is prove to you how much you want your twin. I know that because I've been there myself. And what they realize, and if they are with other people, is how much they want you. And they just want you and you just want them all the time. And this is what's been created in both of your lives. I hope this helps. Have a great day and I'll see you soon.